What? Yeah. Did you see that? Or better, did you hear that? There's nothing. But he's he's talking, but we cannot hear him. And the, the Victron charger, you can change all the settings with the app. You can only hear me. Yeah, that's like with all the other But not Philip. Well. Hey, do you remember the video I made uh, end of August? That's like three and a half months ago about Philip, the guy from the UK, which has multiple sclerosis. And he has upgraded the battery in his mobility scooter from lit acid to lithium iron phosphate. And he was watching my videos and sent me an email and asked the question if it is okay to charge the battery with a DC to DC buck converter. He built his own charger. Quite remarkable, but he used a very, very cheap Chinese brand DC to DC buck converter to charge these batteries. Yes. And I had this idea to start this fundraising for him to get him a proper charger from Victron Energy. Well, and what can I say? A lot of you guys have donated towards this course. We needed only like $380 to buy him his charger. And with the first five donations we got, we already covered the whole amount. But of course, um, people kept um, donating, right? So I really had to stop the fundraising the very next day. I also got in contact with the marketing department of Victron Energy in the Netherlands and asked them if they want to support the fundraising. And I told them, look, this is the situation. We have a fundraising running for buying Philip a charger from Victron Energy. Do you like to support this fundraising? Do you want to do anything, photos, marketing? Do you want to help us out here? And a very nice young lady called Marianka from Victron Energy, from the marketing department, emailed me back and said, well, Victron Energy would like to donate the charger to Philip altogether. And she wanted to organize the handover to Philip and take some photos and use this for their internal promotion. And I emailed her back and said, well, if you want to sponsor the charger to Philip, you take as many photos as you want for the internal promotion. And we even have more money to donate to the Multiple Sclerosis Foundation here in Australia. Helping more people out. So it's a win-win situation. But then things got complicated. So we had all this money raised and also a free charger from Victron Energy as a donation. This was three and a half months ago. And I was sending emails to Victor Energy, to Philip and to the Multiple Sclerosis Foundation here in Australia to, to get rid of this money. You know, I had all this money sitting on my account all the time. Huge amount of money. It really felt wrong to keep all this money. So as soon as Victor Energy confirmed that they would donate the charger to Philip, I donated all the money to the Multiple Sclerosis Foundation here in Australia. And this was a huge amount. This was over 5,400 Australian dollars. Yeah, that's right. That's how much money people donated during one day. Victron organized the handover of this charger to Philip through a representative. He got sick and he couldn't make it to the appointment anymore. He needed to have surgery and couldn't travel. So there was no way for him to hand over this charger to Philip. And because it was a sponsored device, Victron Energy wanted to take some photos as well during the handover. And, and this whole story got really complicated with a lot of back and forward emails between me, Victron Energy and Philip. And we, we couldn't make it work. It, it, just, it just didn't work out. But um, eventually, last week, they arranged the handover. Yeah, Philip has got the charger now. And 
I'm, I'm really sorry I stuffed up this recording last night and there was no audio. I, I really don't know what happened because we have tested everything before with my wife's phone and everything worked fine and we had audio and video and everything was recording. But then I called Philip and the, the recording, well, there was no audio. I mean, we couldn't hear Philip. We couldn't hear what he's saying. And I could see the little recording marking on the mobile phone all the time. Everything seemed fine. So I, I, I really didn't want to bother him again and call him again or make another appointment because I really wanted to make this update about his situation here on the channel. And Philip and I are really, really glad that this is all over now and that he's got his charger before Christmas, can charge his batteries correctly now. And well, what can I say? Philip and myself are really, really grateful for all the people who have donated over 190 people have actually donated towards this charger. So we would really like to thank every single one who has donated money towards this cause. And we would also like to thank Victron Energy in the Netherlands for making this possible and sponsoring the charger for Philip. So probably this was now the longest fundraising in the history of YouTube. I don't know, but it, it felt like it took forever. Well, and because it is only one week until Christmas, I am so glad this is all sorted now. Philip has got his charger. We have all donated the money now to MS Australia. So eventually it all worked out. We have reached the goal. And before I keep working here on my battery shelf, Thank you again to all the donors. Thank you very much to Victron Energy for donating the charger. Merry Christmas to everyone and stay charged.